Hey YouTube, it's Sharice here and I have a haul for you guys. A haul. Sorry, my video just froze again. I have a haul for you guys and it's from Walmart, Kmart, and the Dollar Tree. I'm going to start with Kmart first because I just want to do skincare type stuff and like home type stuff. So one of the first skincare items I got are these little ones, Shea Butter Baby Wipes with vitamin E and they are hyperallergenic and alcohol free and there's 64 in here and I think I paid like a dollar 79 I just use these to take my makeup off before I actually wash my face so that I don't turn everything brown so I love these for removing my makeup and they're moisturizing and soft and uh, I like them if they're safe enough to use on a baby I trust it on my face Moving on to the things I got from the Dollar Tree. Everything that I got from the Dollar Tree was $1 or lesser value. And I spent $40 there, so I got about 40 items. Maybe a little less than 40 items, because a few of the things were less than a dollar. So let's say I got about 35 items. Um, a lot of it is cleaning stuff, which I'm not going to show you what I clean my house with, or the apartment with but I will go into some body stuff so let's start with soap I picked up some Olay soap I love Olay body products and this is just their ultra moisture with shea butter moisture outlast bar and this is just three separate ones they're just stuck together those are a dollar each and then I got some dial the spring water and then just the plain old white bar because they're antibacterial and you always need to use antibacterial soap along with your moisturizing body washes and, and fragrant girly things and stuff like that so I got some soap and then I got some hand soap dial almond milk some moisturizing hand soap because the colder weather is coming I just need to make sure my skin doesn't get dry and that I am disinfecting and killing germs with antibacterial products like Dial, soap. I love me some Dial. Next is all fragrant stuff to like have your apartment or your home smell good. And these are all a dollar. So I got this Airwick Blooming Lilac Air Freshener. And it's the kind that you twist and pull up. You don't pull the cap off like I just did. But you know kind of leave it like this. And you slide it up as much as you can and it like absorbs smells or whatever. And it just smells really nice and fresh and clean. And so I got that to use either out there or in my room. I don't know yet. I like to burn candles in my room so it's probably for the living room. And then I got two from Renews It. Oops. That look like this and it's the same concept. It's like a gel like thing. And this one is apple cinnamon and these are a dollar of course and it smells so good this just smells like fall and just October which is my favorite month of the year and good cinnamon -ness. and this one is after the rain which is a nice fresh smell I love these two smells And then I got a candle to burn. And this candle lasts for up to 25 hours. And it's an air fresh candle from Air Fresh. So I got one Airwick, two Renews It, and then one Air Fresh thing. And this is their Dreamy Vanilla candle. And it just smells really, really good. It smells just like vanilla like vanilla cake or vanilla sugar cookies it smells really good and I like candles so I got this one probably to help me relax and stuff and it says to compare to Airwick which is funny um I also picked up some candy I'll show you the candy I got I got a whole bunch of candy for my students which is probably the majority like half of why like half of the forty dollars I spent is was spent on my students at my um at the high school I teach marching band at but I also picked up some candy for myself because I have a candy problem. And then I actually just got back from BAM, which is why I look kind of shiny and nasty and dirty. But ignore that. I got some Smarties. I love Smarties. 
I got some Werther's Originals Dolce de Leche. Because I never had these kind and they probably taste really good. And they're soft caramels, which I really like. And then I got some of the creamy caramels, like the original ones. Love these. They're chewy. Really bad for people with fillings like myself. Or if you have braces, don't recommend. They will take the brackets off. I used to have braces. But, oh well. YOLO. Now on to the Walmart products. For skincare, I picked up some of my favorite cocoa butter because I ran out of my container that was just like this. And this is the Queen Helen's. This is my favorite one for all year long, summer, winter, fall, spring. And then for skincare, I love to exfoliate, but I ran out of my exfoliators. And um, I like St. Ives exfoliators, so I got the apricot scrub which is something my mom has been using for years. I remember seeing my mom use this in the bathroom when I was like eight years old. So, thanks mom. She likes it, I like it. It's it's kind of abrasive, which I don't have sensitive skin, so I like that it is kind of harsh and abrasive and it really works for me. And I also picked up the Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Tree Scrub, or Green Tea Scrub. And I like this one too, I like the way it smells. So this one is a deep exfoliating, and this is moderate, so I'll probably alternate between the two. Right now my skin's looking fairly decent. I do have one pimple right here, but that's because that time is coming soon. <laughs> and last but not least, I picked up two lipsticks from Milani. And I believe all of these things were really, really cheap. Actually, the most expensive thing is the lipsticks. So the scrubs were $3.87. The cocoa butter was $4.47. And these lipsticks were $4.97 each. So basically $5 a piece. But I love Milani lipsticks. And these are both from their matte collection. And this is Matte Beauty. Which is a nice, pretty nude. I'm anxious to see how this looks on me. Because I love their teddy bear. And it looks... Like on the deeper side so I'm excited for this because this could be a teacher color you know something I can wear when I teach elementary school and then I picked up matte flirty which is a nice like berry purple so fall is coming so I really liked these two colors and I love Milani's matte lipsticks on me so yeah that completes my haul from all the things that I purchased today I spent like $70 total on everything. That's including all the candy I didn't show you that I gave to my students, which is about $20 worth. So you can say I spent, and all the cleaning products I didn't show you. So I spent probably about 50 bucks today on skincare, home care, home cleaning, beauty, all that type of stuff. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, seeing some of the things I like to use and to Stay healthy and moisturized and keep my apartment smelling nice. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your support. See you in the next video.